going to touch on the uh, Jacksonville, the blonde white lady, city inspector that gave the power sports, ATV, motorcycle business a hard time about some flag they were waving, either the American flag, I don't know. Um, I can't remember, but there was a veteran in there. They kind of argued, and she pointed at him. And a bunch of videos were made that took everything out of context, said that she was in a threatening manner towards him, this, that, and the other. But she said, you have done nothing. She meant to say you've done nothing for this country, but she said, in this country or from this country or something. And she got in a lot of hot, hot water, a lot of public outcry. But look, you ask me, she was just expressing her dissatisfaction with these people taking an oath. They go overseas, they kill people, they get paid, they come home, everybody treats them like heroes, women drop to their knees for them. And we have no idea what they really did and what kind of people they really are, right? They just automatically get, you know, exalted. That's not right. You don't do that with anybody. You don't just exalt people for no reason, you know, or destroy people for no good reason. But that's what people do in America. Now, look, she was expressing her dissatisfaction for the fact that they're not doing anything. They're not upholding the Constitution here. In fact, the only thing we hear about them doing, I, I personally, I mean, story after story of what they do here when they come back is get involved in criminal activity drug trafficking, human trafficking, stuff like that, or murder. And they rarely get caught for murder because the military sweeps it under the rug if they can. There's many stories of it. That's why she was doing that. Because look at the state of the country. These people took an oath, so did the police. But I mean, come on, dude. You don't get it? 